Oh, the uh, new um, <coughs> inductor for the butt converter board works. Um, and the switching perform and the um, performance is um, much better now with a um, 50% duty cycle. The output is getting about um, 12 volts. It's putting out 11.8 volts with a 50% roughly duty cycle, which is about what you'd expect. And as I increase it, output potential goes up. Now with about a three quarters duty cycle, 75% of thereabouts, it's about 18 volts. So what this is more along the lines of what you'd expect before with a 50% duty cycle is getting about 16 um, volts because the inductor was too small. Or it was physically bigger than this one, but the inductance was too small. It was only about 80 micro henrys or thereabouts. I've calculated, at least with online calculators, that I should get need about 300 odd mi uh, microfarads. This is a, a one millifarad inductor, but it seems to be working okay. Knock on wood. Uh, one problem that I was having with this is that something had probably because the gate was just exposed uh, on a flying lead. Um, ESD uh, ganked the gate and as a result the FET um, stopped working properly so just had to replace the, um, the put in a new transistor and it works now although fortunately the IRS 2004s that I got which I'm going to use in the updated version of this board which is going to have synchronous rectification um, that is um, logic level and non-inverting so I'll be able to just feed the 5 volt uh, PWM signal from the pick into the um, into the um, FET driver and this right here is the uh, test load it's a, a, a NAS uh, Westinghouse uh, type 313 a 28 volt lamp I think and that is a uh, something like a 32 volt to 40 it's somewhere between 30 volts and 60 volts um, 6s6 uh, indicator lamp you can see the filament just barely glowing there that those two lamps I just have is the output test load right now that's on about 16.9 volts And if you've never seen any of the videos I've done before, this is a um, an IRS-2118 uh, MOSFET driver, the aforementioned um, uh, 2N7000, a, a, PS, um, a MOSFET, a, a PSMN4 6-60PS um, power um, N-channel MOSFET, which is being used as the main switch, and an MBR2535 sh uh, dual shot key rectifier with both rectifiers being wired in parallel in this application. What I'm going to do is build an updated version of this board which employs a pair of PSMN 46-60 PS MOSFETs as one of which is the um, input switch, one of which is the um, serving as a synchronous rectifier. The two IRS 2004 can do is a designed for half bridge applications like what I'm doing and then I'm going to just going to have another shocky rectifier wired in parallel with the um, right with the MOSFET serving as a synchronous rectifier to reduce switching losses because otherwise it, the um, parasitic diode in the MOSFET which has much higher forward potential than a shaky rectifier would would be conducting during the period when neither MOSFET is turned on and that would have much higher losses so anyways yeah it works yay then those are the LEDs that are still on the board from the test program I wrote for the idiot test program which I've already posted a video on.